What would you name this look? I didn't know what to call it, so I went with metallic eyes and V-Cole. I hear laughing in my head. Good thing I ditched golden pomegranate eyes. This eye makeup may look formal but it's really not. Yes, you could wear it to a wedding, but it wouldn't look OTT if you wore it on a family picnic either. You'll see asterisk 5 split this tutorial into two, so that I get to show you in detail how I did the eyeliner, as well products I used. Shimmery Cream by Shadow Maybellin 24HR Color Tattoo Metallic Pomegranate or Pomegranate Punk Gold Eye Shadow Urban Decay Half Baked from Naked Palette. Black Coal and Eye Shadow Black Me Coal Ultimate. Bourjois Intense Eye Shadow and Mascaras Maybellin The Fall Sees Black Palm and Bourjois Fantastic Volume. Brushes Sigma E25 Blending Brush. Urban Decay Good Garment Brush. First tutorial is the metallic eye shadow. 1. Take metallic pomegranate on ring finger. 2. Apply it on your lid till your crease. 3. It should look like that. It's okay if the edges aren't neat right now. 4. Now take the same color tattoo on a fluffy blending brush, and go over the edges of the shadow using windshield wiper and circular motions. 5. Keep blending from one end to the other. 6. Once the edges look hazy, apply a gold eye shadow on the inner half of your lid, but don't touch the upper edge of the previous VS. 7. Apply the gold on your inner corner around your tear duct, as well. 8. Apply the same gold VS on the outer half of lower lash line. 9. Apply the same metallic pomegranate on the inner half of lower lash line. Asterisk I am doing this to balance the look. 10. Line your top and bottom waterline with black coal pencil. Tutorial below. 11. Apply lots of mascara on top and bottom lashes. I applied three coats of Maybellin the Fall Seas Black Prom first, then about two to three coats of Bourjois Fantastic Volume Mascara. Lashes look more clumpy up, close only. 12. Done. Now, on to the second tutorial, the V-Cole one. Sharpen your coal pencil first, then tight line upper lash line. That means lining up the roots of your lashes. 2. Line water line all the way to the inner tear duct area. 3. See how that closes up my eye and makes it look smaller. 4. Start lining the top lash line. It's better not to drag it in one go. Make dots and join, instead. 5. Make coal thicker at the outer corner. Extend it a little past the corner of your eye. 6. It should look like that. 7. That white line is just to show you how to join with it with the lower lash line. 8. From the tip of upper coal, line downwards toward lower lash line, stopping before the edge of your eyeball, allowing the gold VS to still show. Fill inside the V or the 9. Lastly, Take some matte black eye shadow on an angled or pointed liner brush and press it on cold. Again, don't drag the brush. This will prevent it from smudging and also even out the edges. 10. Just mimic the previous steps. Press black eye shadow on lower lash line. 11 dot and upper lash line. 12. Done. It's my favorite way to line my eyes, that is when my coal is sharp. Bollywood actresses like by Pasha Basu, Rani Mukherjee and A. She went out of Rani line their eyes this way a lot. If you line all the way in on the bottom lash line, you'll achieve Rani Mukherjee's heavy coal head eyes like I did in the Bombay Talkies inspired look. Hope you picked up some tips from these two tuts to dot toots dot. I will be posting more before the month ends. Thank you for watching this video.